coated with Bacaban. Uh, it's last time it was coated was about two weeks ago, and so I'm going to uh, recoat it now. By putting Bacaban on, I'm putting an easy clean anti pathogen coating on the phone. But just to show you how easy clean it is, I'm going to put some grease on the phone, really greasy finger mark there. Now I'm just going to wipe it off. It's completely gone. But the most important thing is that this phone is completely anti-pathogen, so it's protected against all pathogens. Most people's phones are a disaster area for pathogens. So let's see how we coat a phone with Bacaban. To coat a phone, a phone with Bacaban is really straightforward. What we're going to do is we're going to moisten <coughs> tissue, we're going to wipe it over with Bacaban, and as we try to protect the whole phone, we're going to do it everywhere. Doesn't matter if it gets on your fingers, it's a it will just clean any pathogens off your fingers. So we put it on there and we're going to leave it for five minutes. That's all we have to do. Afterwards we're going to buff it. So we just rub it and we leave it. Okay. So we've let it dry for five minutes and you'll see that it, it looks a bit smeary, a bit speckly. That's completely normal. So what we do is we just get a microfiber. We're only taking off the excess and we're leaving the, the other the coating in place just round the back. You can get your fingers on it, won't damage anything. Then you put that in your pocket and that is a completely sanitized phone. And there's nothing else available that will do the same job as Bacaban for a phone. It's been used in, in hospitals in the UK. Now, what you will find is that initially it will feel a little slower, not quite as smooth as it did before. But in a day from now, it then gets really smooth and it feels like smoother than ever. But uh, that's just as the, the, the coating uh, evens, evens out slightly. But the main thing, that is a completely anti-pathogen and now easy clean phone.